What do you think of the term woke capitalism as a part of corporation aligning with cancel culture? Josh Hawley recently used it in describing how Coca-Cola and MLB are boycotting Georgia election rules, term, pa uh, term package deal. Yeah, they, I mean, woke is not really a concept. It's, it's kind of a vague term to describe a certain attitude on the left. Uh, I, I don't think it can really apply to capitalism, to, to corporations, and certainly it shouldn't be aligned with capitalism. I mean, it would fit Josh Hawley, who has no clue what capitalism is, and, and, and it is a reject of capitalism wholeheartedly, to associate the term capitalism with woke. You could say these corporations are behaving in a woke fashion. That's fine. You can say these corporations are towing the democratic line uh, as virtue signaling, that's fine, but woke is not a concept. Uh, you know, it's 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 it. Nobody's defined it. It's not. There's no clear uh, definition or even clear description of what it means. Uh, it's applied to a variety of different things, and it's primarily applied to the left. And and in terms of corporations, yeah, I mean, corporations have done this forever. How many corporations threatened the the, the NFL around uh, taking the knee right on the on the right? How many people threat when, when uh, Kaepernick took the knee and football players took the knee? How many corporations said they wouldn't advertise or they wouldn't be associated? You know, yeah, corporations take political stands depending who's president, depending on where they think the wind is blowing. It's pragmatism. It's awful. Um, but it's, you know, don't make too much out of it. Is, is Coca-Cola and... And uh, Delta really going to move their headquarters out of Atlanta? I doubt it. They're going to make some, uh, you know, comments to show that they're on the right side of political correctness. And then they're going to close their mouths because Georgia is still a primarily Democratic, uh, Republic, sorry, Republican state. They don't want to piss off their customers in Georgia. So they're not going to make too big of a deal. Imagine if Republican Georgians stop flying Delta. That won't be good for Delta, and Delta knows it. So they're going to be very, very cautious. Somebody says, isn't woke an acceptance of the basics of communist net worldview? Not at all. I don't think woke and communism have any connection. Uh, indeed, uh, wokeism is, is anti-communist because the communists, certainly the communist ideology is anti-woke. Woke has a lot more to do with critical race theory, with postmodernism, with, uh, with nihilism and, and the complete... You know, just the just the, the the what's it called intersectionality than it does with Marxism or communism. Marxism is not postmodern. Marxism is not critical race theory. Marxism is not um, uh, intersectionality. These things, in a sense, are much worse than Marxism. They are real egalitarianism uh, in a way that communism is not. Right? I, I don't want to <laughs> pretend for one second that anybody think I'm defending communism. But communism is, is uh, way ahead in every respect than, uh, you know, intersectionality, critical race theory, woke, whatever, wokeism, if you want to call it that, all of this. This is about nihilism. This is about tearing stuff down. This is about destroying. Communism at least has the pretense of utopia as, as, as a goal in there. What is the utopia of critical race theory? What is utopia of postmodernism? What is utopia of wokeism? There is no such thing. There is no such thing. It is the annihilation of anybody who's a little bit better than anybody else, which means everybody. It's the annihilation of everybody until the last, weakest person on planet Earth is left. Right? So... Uh, there is, you know, maybe somebody has a definition of woke, but I haven't seen one. It's, it's very vague. It's very, uh, uh, it, it's very questionable about whether it, 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 it's just a, it's a term that people throw out there for what we used to call a political correctness, but much worse, right? And it includes the whole cancel culture affiliated with it. And it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's a bunch of different things. It's not a package deal because there's no positives that go into the woke. Woke is all negative. It's a, it's a bad attitude, but I don't think it's a clear-cut, definable term. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think so. Uh, I certainly don't think that uh, it is, has anything to do with communism. Communists believe in 
in, uh, in discrimination. All kinds of discrimination, based on all kinds of parameters. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think. Meaning, any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence, and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brutes. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes. That should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see, see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something, the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see your actual views being reflected in the likes. But uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share and uh, you can support the show at youronbookshow.com slash support or on Patreon or Subscribestar or Locals uh, and, uh, and show your support for, all, for, for, for the work, for the value hopefully you're receiving from this. And, uh, and of course, don't forget, if you're not a subscriber, even if, you, even if you just come here to troll or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe because that way you'll know when to show up. You'll know what shows are on, when they're on. You'll get notified, right? So, um, yes, like, share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please. <laughs>